Hey friends, Mark Holmes here, and as always, thank you guys for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, you know this does not work without you guys. Today has been one of those tragic days with Kobe Bryant being in a helicopter accident with his 13-year-old daughter, as well as seven others. There were no survivors. I saw a clip. I don't know if that was a legitimate clip or not, but if it was... It was a fireball that was falling from the sky. And it, it's just a sad day that, you know, uh, uh, 41 years old is just too young, especially his daughter, 13. Um, it makes you realize your own mortality. There's such an outpour of heartbroken and feelings going on right now from Shaquille O'Neal to Magic Johnson. I mean, when you listen to the quote for Magic Johnson, I've been trying to write this post. My mind is racing. I'm in disbelief and I've been crying all morning over this devastation news that Kobe and his young daughter, Gigi, have passed away in hell about to crash. Cookie and I are heartbroken. There's so many people. I love him and his family and what stood for what he stood for on the court and off the court. My friend, a legend, husband, father, brother, Oscar winner and greatest Laker of all time is gone. It's hard to accept. Kobe was a leader of our game, a mentor to both male and females. Um it's one of those things that you don't even know what words to put behind this that I, I'm not even sure what to say um, I thought I knew what I was going to say but I just don't in my own life I always tell you guys that time waits for nobody and that time is the most precious commodity there is because time, you can't buy it, you can't trade it, you can't get any more of it. It's more precious than gold, silver, or platinum. And we all want more time. But the reality is you only have so much. And I have been trying in my life to do everything I can to take care of my family, my wife, enjoy life, be a good example for others, and help others along the way. I think that's all that any of us can do. I know sometimes I push the limit of what I should be trying to do. This um, trip and trying to get ready for it, I have literally been running around like a chicken with my head cut off. Um, I haven't been sleeping much. I'm trying to get content out to everybody um, because I want to succeed. This incident reminds you that life is present. That you need to make sure that everybody knows, not tomorrow, not next week, not next month, today, right now, how you feel about them because you don't know if you have a tomorrow. I've always lived that way. I don't really have the words to put out here on this one. I just want to say I'm sorry to his surviving wife and kids and that he'll be missed. He was, whether you liked him or hated him, you respected him 
because he was one of the greatest basketball players of all time. Nobody should have to go that way at that age. I'm Mark Holmes, and well, I got to slow the F down myself. I apologize that I haven't been getting much content out to you guys. I have really not been feeling good, and I felt today just really to the point of exhaustion. And I, I've got to get some rest. Thank you guys as always. Um, I'll talk to you later.